Hello everyone, TechnoSooth Craig Chamberlain here. This is the virus removal series where I try my very best to show you how to remove those tough to remove viruses. Welcome to episode three and today we're going to do something really quick and I'm hoping you're bearing with me on this. Remember there's no one way to remove viruses. There's just a number of techniques you can try to use to, you know, eliminate the threat. So first thing you need to do in this episode is just scroll down the bottom left hand corner and we're going to show you how to boot your Windows operating system in safe mode with networking. Just select run, type in msconfig, m-s-c-o-n-f-i-g, press enter. Scroll up to the boot.ini tab, select it. Check off the slash safe boot and select network. And then just click apply, click close, and then select restart. Now, another way to boot in safe mode is to actually... Restart your computer by going to start and then turn off computer. And while your computer is booting up, repeatedly press the F8 key and keep pressing it until you are greeted with this screen. It'll look similar to this. And just go up with your keyboard and press enter on safe mode with networking. And uh, just so you know, if your Windows XP splash screen, your visual Windows XP splash screen comes up, that means you haven't pressed F8 on time properly. Now the reason I showed you how to do it the other way is because some USB keyboards and BIOSes won't let you use the F8 strategy. So I prefer to actually use the start and run command. But remember, to make it not boot in safe mode, you have to go back into msconfig. Go back to your boot.ini and make sure that you uncheck safe boot, select apply, and click close, and then restart again. Otherwise, it's just going to boot in safe mode every time you restart your computer. And that's all there is for this lesson today. Stay tuned, and in the next episode, we're actually going to start running software while in safe mode. Thanks again.